This place is dark. Well, well, my fair lady. Is this rundown factory and these incompetent fools all for me? Wow. You shouldn't have. Huh. <laughs> what do you have to gain from belittling your subordinates? You might not want to admit it, but you are a part of this plan. Perhaps you find fighting in the Abyss to be a more meaningful use of your time? Oh, but of course, even this pales in comparison to being experimented on by the Doctor. <laughs> what a sharp tongue you have. Funny how negotiating never seems to be your strong suit. For the task ahead, I suggest you keep your true feelings to yourself. Hm, <laughs> save your breath. I know what I have to do. I'm sure you think so, but I still think you need to hear it. Don't start thinking you're invincible, and don't let your emotions get in the way. Surely you're not worried about me. I just can't have you getting in my way. You and Child never fail to find ways to complicate things. I'm merely lighting a little fire in this chaotic nation. But you, being tossed out like trash, must make you want to destroy it completely. Do you remember the last time you were here? That was a lot of swordsmiths you killed. I'm sure the descendants of the Ride in Gokaden are still suffering the consequences now. Look at you. Oh, don't get so sentimental. Now, give that poor little tongue of yours a rest and stop pretending like you're above everyone else. Bye then. See you at the victory feast. Poor little tongue? <laughs> She's playing with fire talking to me like that. Who does she think she is? <sighs> Forget it. Someone might find me here any minute now. I should prepare to give them a warm welcome. Hmm. <sighs>